loves me so Jesus loves me so Loves me so Loves me so Jesus loves me so It is time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. It's your buddy Devin, and this is a magnifying glass. It makes little things like this bug look bigger. Pretty cool, huh? Only this is not a real bug. I've been trying to start my bug collection, but I can't seem to find any real ones. I guess you could call me a bug lover. I just love bugs. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Devin. Who? Who? Does that magnifying glass belong to you? Hey, Ollie. It does. I got it for Christmas to look for bugs with. But I haven't found any real ones yet. Patience can be hard. You know that is true. I've got a story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. So nice. Oh, hi friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. Great to see you. Look at what I'm delivering today. Valentines. Have you ever gotten one of these? These are cards people make each other to show they love them. This one is oh, to a friend. And this one is from a mom to her daughter. And this one is from one classmate to another. <laughs> Look. It's Ollie. These are so great. 
I just love a day when people show love to each other. But you know what? Even if your mailbox was full of a million, billion, trillion Valentine. Whoa, whoa, that's a lot of Valentines. There's someone who loves you even more than all these Valentines. It's true. Here, let me tell you a story. Okay, so the true story from the Bible begins with a big crowd of people. Watch out, whoa, here they come. <laughs> I wonder what they came to see. Do you think they're here to watch a movie? No, it's better than a movie. Maybe they came for a birthday party. Nope, it's better than a birthday party. They came to listen to Jesus. Jesus, God's son, was telling stories to a crowd about what God is like and who is important to him. Now get out your pretend binoculars because there are a lot of important people in this crowd that I want to show you. Got them up to your eyes? Great, now let's look and see who can we see. I see moms, dads, grandmas, grandpas, aunts and uncles. Wow, so many important people. Let's keep looking. Oh, wow, look. Who are those people? Children, you're right. Wait, where are they going? Let's follow them. They're going up to Jesus, but uh-oh. Look who's coming to stop them. It's Jesus' friends, the disciples. They wanted the children to go back to their families. They don't think Jesus will want to see them. But look, Jesus wants the children to come to him. He's smiling. Jesus said, let the little children come to me. Children are so important to Jesus. He loves you more than a million, trillion, billion Valentines. And if you were in a crowd full of important people today, he would hold out his arms to you and say, come to me. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who loves you? Jesus loves me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who loves you? Jesus loves me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story. It's all true. Jesus loves me and Jesus loves you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Jesus wanted all the children to come to him. Jesus wants to be near us because he loves us so much. I love all the things about bugs, but Jesus' love is bigger. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Good. I'm going to go back to my bug hunt. You guys keep hunting for bugs too. See you next time. Bye.